I want to talk to you about Unicent or POS and today's conversation we want to review uh, this tool to see whether or not it's uh, the, the appropriate that's sold for you. So Unicent or POS, point of sale system, okay? So here's an overview I want you to pay attention to. So when you think about Unicent, what should you be thinking about? Well, it's a very popular fr free POS system. I want to insist on that free and popular, okay? So the Unicenter platform is open source, so developers and programmers in your organization can make changes to the software and customize it to suit your business. Now, of course, you got to have some programming background to be able to use uh, this uh, Unicenter POS software, right? But it, it is a wonderful opportunity. What we love about the Unicenter is that uh, you are able to uh, customize things uh, in a very scalable way. It doesn't matter if you're a small business or a large enterprise. You can actually uh, take advantage of uh, the, this uh, free POS. So whether you own a bike shop, a cafe, a bar, or a restaurant business, this installed based POS system can help you uh, automate uh, inventory management, process sales quickly, let's say uh, generate reports, and collect customer data so you can market to them later. So the cool thing is that you have a client relationship management aspect of things also. You can set various access levels based on users, whether managers or bartenders. If you own a retail business, you can assign specific customer uh, account to a sale, for instance. You can look up customers, you can set discounts, you can offer layaways. The possibilities are really, really endless. You can use the supplier, the supplier module to manage accounts, request an order, check credit limits, and keep tracks of uh, your deliveries. You can pull up any uh, previous orders or sales to monitor your past orders. So this is really cool. And Unicenter POS also offers uh, capabilities like uh, offline transaction cap tr transaction uh, opportunities. And uh, you also have the ability to uh, customize specific data fields depending on the niche you're in. And that's really good. So when you think about Unicenter, I want you to think about a very user-friendly tool. It's an open source. I've already said this before. It's an open source point of sale system that's uh, really great for mul multiple locations, multiple terminals, and this is really great. So it, it, it is scalable. In other words, it is uh, it can be commercial grade or it could be suitable for small uh, small businesses. I want to talk to you now about uh, the features that you can you can really expect to have within uh, Unicenter. So let's go about the features. I want to talk to you about sales monitoring. I want to talk to you also about operation and, and uh, interface suite. I want to talk about inventory and supply, employee directory. And uh, so when we talk about, I want to first talk about sales monitoring. So basically the sales feature in the Unicenter POS system, it's all about payments, orders and um, orders of items against the inventory and availability of stock. So you, you're constantly balancing your uh, inflows and outflows of inventory. And then this makes it very easy to monitor the stock as well as sales in your business. And the feature offers account management and access levels as well. So with regards to account management, the system allows for two types of users. You have admin and you have customer accounts. And the customer accounts uh, allow your customers to browse the store inventory, reserve items, as well as make online purchases. So you have the ability to actually uh, balance your cost of sales versus your revenue. You can use, uh, if you use the admin accounts, you will be able to uh, keep track of the inventory and coordinate with the store staff in a more efficient manner. And then you have operation and interface suite. So this feature is a, a constellation of tools that are meant to streamline managerial tasks for you. With search capabilities, you'll be able to uh, digitally register and log data into your databases. And the cool thing about Unicenta is that it allows you to uh, register any scanned barcode and display the price for each item. The system can also accept credit and debit card payments, so that's really fantastic. You also have inventory and supply. The, so the inventory suite on the Unicenta retail POS system is packed with uh, a constellation of features to help you monitor the available merchandise in your business. And this feature will ensure that your customers have a steady supply of what they need at any given time. And uh, the, the what we love about the supply feature is that you are always able to know uh, how much or what quantities your vendors are willing to supply. For the employee, uh, the employee directory, 
the system features a superior employee management features as well. And those tools will let you keep track of the performance of your staff members, restrictions, access levels, and monitor employee behavior. You can restrict employee access to the POS system based on their positions and roles within the company. I want to talk to you now about the differentiators you can really have when you think about Unicenter. So the feature though, you have a tool that features data import and export capabilities. The tool comes with uh, an intuitive dashboard and convenient notifications. You, you have a, a, an assortment of customer management tools, especially when they revolve around CRM. It also features a secure and affordable payment processor. The tool supports external integrations and has uh, an open API. That's really fantastic. And, uh, but when we talk about the, the differentiators, you need to really understand that customizing reports and special discounts on the Unicenter POS system is kind of difficult because it requires a certain level of software and programming language. I think that's what I said before in terms of coding. So whether you're running a bike shop, a cafe, a bar, POS systems are an essential part of any business because they automate inventory management, streamline managerial tasks, and help you generate reports to improve sales and revenue and the focus should be should be on that sales and revenue optimization and uh, one thing i want to say here is that uh, when we talk about unicenter we are talking about the fact that you have you have the ability to have very granular reports and that's the big differentiator but those but the the customization process requires a certain level of technological sophistication so if you are thinking of, of investing in a pos system such as unicenter it's a great idea to find out how much time the vendor needs to install and implement the business app. In this case, you, because you this is an open source software. And uh, so you, you got to really look at the, the kind of staff you have. There are skills because they will be able to do, they will be doing the customization. You also need to find out how many employees the, the Unicenter actually uh, is willing to actually uh, outsource to your organization if you really need that. And you, you want to make sure that uh, you have a, uh, a strong community of Unicenter users on which you can tap onto. I mean, on which you can tap if you are asking for, let's say, uh, advice, right? Let's say you want to, you are asking for questions or, or recommendations. You want to make sure that those user users will be there for you when, uh, when push comes to shove. Let me talk to you about the value added of uh, Unicenter. When you think about Unicenter POS, I want you to think about uh, value added in terms of a bar barcode scanning. You have customer account profiles. You have discount management. You have e-commerce. You have a uh, inventory management. That's really cool. Another area we love when it comes to Unicenter is that you have layaway management. This is an another uh, strong area where you have the ability to get things done a lot faster. You have pricing management, restaurant POS, sales tracking, touch screen. That's just really fantastic. But just keep in mind that the, the real value that uh, Unicenter adds is the fact that it is uh, an open source software tool. It is a free open source software tool. And so basically uh, you are able to use uh, the tool, whether you're a small business or a medium sized enterprise. If you're a large enterprise, you're not going to uh, enjoy uh, the capabilities that come with uh, but you understand that much because you will find them restrictive. Okay. And uh, we love the fact that with Unicenter, you have a tool that really adds value when it comes to a uh, barcode scanning, when it comes to a uh, customer account profiles, inventory management, e-commerce. And uh, you also love that. We love the fact that you have a, a restaurant POS capability. Now there are no license fees. There is no vendor lock-in. You can install on as many terminal in as in terminals, in as many uh, locations as you need you get the application and source code that's really cool and you are saving your business in the process thousands of dollars i mean if you were to go with if you were to go to the competition for instance you'll be paying like crazy and unicenter is really uh, giving you a lot of uh, flexibility there you are able to uh, avail yourself of a tool and really optimize your inventory optimize your client relationship management optimize your loyalty program management optimize your uh, supply chain management among other things and you can do so free of charge of course there's nothing free you have to uh, still pay for the resources the internal resources that you will allocate to uh, do the programming 
But hey, listen, you don't have to pay anything to any vendor. Let me talk to you about the cost here. So I, I think right by now, you know the cost of Unicenter. Unicenter is a free, but as you can see on the screen here, it is free to a certain extent. Now, if you want to actually, uh, if you will love Unicenter to actually get back to you and uh, sort of help you out with certain kind, some kinds of customization, you have to pay for it. Okay. Now the prices here that you have on the screen are in pounds. Now we reached out to them and we wanted to have a, a dollar equivalent. And they told us that on that day where we actually came, I mean, not that day on the week where we came, the, the website was under, uh, under some kind of redesign. So they only had the prices for pounds, but just multiply this by 1.2. So $60 for the base, that will be about $120. Okay, and uh, sorry, what, what am I saying here? $60, we're speaking about $72 for one year. And for the plus, you have 136 plus uh, times 1.2, you are around 150. I mean, give or take, okay? My math is not really strong right now. So long story short, what I'm trying to say here is that you have the ability to have a, a, to know exactly what you're looking for and Unicenter can help you out. Even though the uh, the software overall is free, if you need some kind of help, some kind of customization help, the company is willing to help you do that. Okay. So they're charging you 70, uh, 78, 75, 80 bucks per year for the base plan. And on, on the uh, plus plan, 180, you know, it's still, it's still good. Now the Unicenter base plan is suited for small or medium sized businesses. And uh, so basically uh, when you pay this, you will get regular Unicenter or POS uh, updates user guides, all source codes, and access to the Unicenter expert online support and knowledge base. Some of the appealing capabilities offered by this subscription plan include web reporting, remote order display, standard form forum support, developers guides, and support. And for the Unicenter Plus subscription plan, basically this is suited for tech savvy businesses and POS resellers with this plan. You will get access to a, a knowledge base by the provider to help you install and customize the system to your requirements. So that's really good. And in addition to the software download and, and updates, the subscription offers all the capabilities offered by the base plan that I described to you earlier. So that's really good for, uh, for the price that they're charging. I want to talk to you about the specs here. So when we talk about Unicenter, what kind of specs do we have? I want to talk to you about the Unicenter POS hardware and system requirements. And this Unicenter POS system is designed to run on almost any third party software, saving you a considerable amount of money on hardware costs. However, the computer you intend to install the, the software on needs to have at least 512, 512 megabytes of RAM memory, hard disk space of at least 70 megabytes. Okay. And if you will be running the software on Windows XP, SP3, 32-bit or 64-bit, you need to have Java 1.7 JRE. If you'll be installing it on a 32-bit or 64-bit Windows 7 or 8, you need to have Java 1.8 JRE installed as well. So this is the th those are the specs you need to really think about. Now, one thing I want to say here is that when we talk about uh, the, uh, the, uh, the, the specs, those specs are not really dependent upon the size of your business okay of course if, if you reach out to unicenter and really talk to them about the base plan or the plus subscription plan maybe they'll tell you hey, listen the specs you currently have are not really uh, suitable to the the requirements you have and they might really help you uh, tweak those specs to make sure that you actually uh your uh, tech stack complies with uh, the unicenter sort of uh i would say uh optimal requirements but the bottom line here is what the bottom line is you in any case you want to contact Unicenter first, have a conversation and see whether or not you can do you can do things on your own or if you need help. Right. Because if you have the programming knowledge in house, you can do things on yourself. You can do things on your own. Rather, that's not a problem. But a lot of small businesses, especially startups who are just trying to have a free POS, they just want to uh, configure. They want to customize things that you might need actually uh, a, a plan such as the subscription plan that I just spoke to you a little earlier. But in any case, you have to really, you have to analyze your situation, analyze your operational activity, analyze your uh, your traffic flow, your inflow and outflow of, of uh, customer traffic, 
and see what the kind of POS you will need in the first place. Let me give you our opinion here. So what is our final verdict? Is Unicenter POS actually worth it? Definitely yes, definitely yes. This is actually a, a great POS software tool, but the thing is that simply because it is free, simply because it is open source, doesn't mean that you everybody can actually take advantage of it because you got to have a certain uh, knowledge, a certain prior knowledge to be able to really uh, understand first and customize the tool to your to your liking. The, so the Unicenter POS happens to be one of uh, the retail management solutions for hospitality, small and medium sized en entities and retail businesses. It really features advanced inventory management, barcode scanning, customer and employee management to capabilities. And if you're a small business right now, you are listening to me and you don't have programming knowledge in your, in your within the company, you have the ability to actually uh, reach out to Unicenter and either get uh, the base plan where they're charging you about uh, 70 or 80 bucks per year, or you can get the, the plus the plus plan where you pay double that and you have everything. You have a uh, all, uh, all the features, you have all the capabilities, you have the things done to your uh, to your liking, really. So, But Unicenter is based in, uh, in, in the UK, and uh, the company was founded in uh, 2010, so they've been around for a while now. I mean, nearly 15 years, which is a lot when it comes to POS, because the POS industry is uh, kind of uh, nascent, too. I mean, uh, before we had uh, we had cash registers. We have we had other types of registers, but the, but the online POS, the cloud-based POS, this is a really nascent industry. So, long story short, if you're interested in reaching out to Unicenter, you can call them. The number is 4420-3051-8601. Again, this is a, a UK-based company, so country code 4420-3051-8601. So this is kind of cool, but yeah, long story short. This is a, a worthy tool. This is a worthy uh, software tool for POS and inventory management, especially because you have salient features such as system capability management, sales management, inventory management, supplier management, customer management, employee management, and reporting and analytics. Fantastic. And uh, this tool works on Windows, Linux, and Mac cloud. You, you have a cloud and local hosting options. This is really good. And uh, but the one thing you need to really understand is that uh, you have to really reach out to Unicenter first to see whether or not the tool is suitable for the kind of operation you currently have. Unless you have the, the knowledge in house, you want to reach out to the company first. Thank you so much for your attention. I really appreciate it. in today's conversation. I was just talking to you about Unicenter POS. And here's a recap here. I give you the overview, the features, the differentiators, the value added, the cost, the specs, and our opinion. Thank you so much. God bless you. I'll see you next time. Until then, remember, stay marvelous.